BBC podcast host Deborah James, who has incurable bowel cancer, took to Twitter and shared she is gutted after it was announced that Tom Parker has sadly died at the age of 33. The Wanted star told fans in October 2020 that he had been diagnosed with an inoperable brain tumor. Deborah, 40, has been living with stage 4 bowel cancer since she was diagnosed in December 2016, and was told early on that she might not live beyond 5 years, a milestone that passed in the autumn of 2021. The podcast host took to the micro-blogging site and shared her devastation over the news of Tom's death, someone she had stayed in regular contact with. She said the pair were a part of the same club and added that it was unfair for the musician's life to be taken away at such a young age. In view of her 41,000 followers, Deborah penned, I'm gutted by hearing this. I would text with Tom often about being part of the club we never wanted and it's just so unfair to hear of another life taken too young. He fought, and yes I'm using that word, but my word he did, so hard. My thoughts are with Kelsey and his family. She was inundated with supportive messages following her heartbreaking post. Twitter user, Marie Ann wrote, I can't imagine what Tom's family are feeling but also how you feel seeing this. The struggle for you goes on and I wish you peace and strength. God bless. Avril Martin commented, so very, very sorry to hear such sad news. Lisa Lindley remarked, just reading about Tom when your tweet came through. Absolutely tragic. Hope that you're okay and you just keep fighting. Shirley Watmoff offered, life is so unfair sometimes. Sally Borman added, absolutely devastating. My heart breaks for his wife and beautiful family. Bruce Willis steps away from acting after brain condition diagnosis latest Paul McCartney pays emotional tribute to Foo Fighters Taylor Hawkins tributes Andrea McLean's family were forced to flee home as she aids Ukraine exclusive, Tom's wife Kelsey Hardwick wrote on Instagram, our hearts are broken. She added, Tom was the center of our world. We can't imagine life without his infectious smile and energetic presence. Her post continued, We are truly thankful for the outpouring of love and support and ask that we all unite to ensure Tom's light continues to shine for his beautiful children. Thank you to everyone who has supported in his care throughout, he fought until the very end. I'm forever proud of you. The couple married in 2018 and had a daughter, Aurelia Rose, and a son, Bodhi. Meanwhile, at the start of the year, Deborah announced she had nearly died in hospital, calling it the hardest part of her five-year cancer battle, and was admitted as an inpatient earlier this month. Earlier this month, the campaigner announced that she was admitted back to the hospital after suffering an infection. The mom of two continues to receive inpatient treatment, but was allowed home over the weekend to spend Mother's Day with her family.